Hey everyone, Son of Beast and Terry Crews here. This is NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs 24 on EA Sports. Hello everyone, Boomer here. Welcome to another Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. It's been a long night here since the Flyers and the Hurricanes are battling out in Game 4 all the way to the third overtime period of this season. This has been really like a long part of the event, and I have never seen what anyone does. But as you may already know, this has been like a atrocious amount of time between the first regulation period, first and third period in the regulation, and then the first overtime to the third overtime in the game period, and it happened just how it did. So, it's just a great amount of game as the Hurricanes move along to face against the winning team on the other side. We may not know who are they playing against, but it's in between the Bolts and the Order Rangers. Now, let's get the next game started. Florida Panthers are facing against the Toronto Maple Leafs in Scotia Bank Arena. I will have the next commentary tip. The next one I have is you all call the name for. It's what you all been seeing for one of the biggest. It's the name, and I got a call for one of each. It's all for you all people who may have recognized it before. This next one is, of course you know, light bulb along with ballpoint pen. And the third commentary will be all you never remembered, Tyler Beats. And the center ice will be all remain as Silver Spoon will take some a little and shove it in, in between the players of the bound. Now let's send you down to Toronto, Canada for the second game of the afternoon before tonight's game. Enjoy the game, folks. It's that time for Slight Bulb along with Ballpoint Pen and Tyler Beats. This is NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. And here we are. We're ready to start things off for Game 2 in Toronto. Game 4 of the night. The starting goal tip is in between of Samsonov and Bukharovsky as Lybushi will have the puck. Riley will have his own time taking over again to Marner. Marner now finds it over to get a Labushka again to Riley. Riley takes his way down, finding Labushka. Here's Marner with a shot. This one's stopped here by, by Bobrovsky. Riley will give it over to Labushka. And now give a pass back over to get to Riley. And now he's with the puck. Takes a look in the middle for Marner and it's stopped by Bobrovsky. This starts things off here with two games lost here in home and only one game that happened to be a win at Toronto. And it wasn't enough day since they've already lost in game three against the Leafs. And they score! First goal of the night goes to Morgan Riley. Start things up, one nothing. Now here's what I expected here. This was happened like Morgan Riley after the face-off was putting up a lot of timing. You know, that heat sinker was really going to take all the timing. But this angle is never going to help. This one really starts things off here. A great goal. Yeah, I was pretty seeing it before. I knew it really like it looked like they were going all over again. I was seeing that the heat sinker was taking over at advantage skill. That one turned to be like it's a great shot at the goal angle. That turned to be like it's great. And now to start one putting it here for Mike Wishkin here with under 18 minutes to start here in the first period. Great early lead for the Toronto Maple Leafs as Nylander will have it. On the backhander, it's has been knocked out and Spenny will have it over. Kachuk with the puck. Loses the puck as the Maple Leafs will have their back. Now the Leafs will have it as Riley will have it in the center of the zone. Now finally again to Bertuzzi. Here goes again to Domi. Domi. Spins around the backhand and almost made that one impossible goal. That better angle has to be right because if he doesn't get that one in straight, he's got to make sure he has that in the right timing that he has done. A lot of aggressiveness is a takeover in between. That stop puts in by Samsonov. 
an ultimate way. You, you got to make sure when you're playing an offense with the run of skills tackle, this matchup can be a little intense. They must need to know if they can try to keep that one handling for as strong as they can get. A lot of time left in the first period. It's still a one nothing game for Toronto Maple Leafs. The Leafs wins the faceoff, and now here's Brody. Brody on the back of the side, now finding again to John Rock. John Rock is right to make man. Finds a look over, now with an open look. Brody now finds McMahon. McMahon now finds Brody. Brody tries to give off to McMahon's shot. And it's blocked or saved here by Bobrovsky. Brody gives to Logren. Logren's shot, and if saved, puts him back. Valley will lose cover the chain. Now here's Logren, and John Crook will have it. John Crook over now to the Veers. He lost that puck right now as Montour will have it. The better play in this offense, I've really got a good, good feeling right in between. It's what they do. A lot of percentage of it is taking a lot of time and swinging off ahead. However, they're really like putting a lot of pressure in between. I have to find out if there is another takeover with the puck, and they, they've got to really make sure to get that one in the head. Oh, big takedown here. Now he finds it over to Reese, and this one's shot has been stopped by Sam Samsonov. Lichtran can't find a puck open pass. Camp's got it now, and he will have to leave it out of the zone. And Brody will now have to give it over to Lindgren. Here's the pass over to Nees, and now he will give it off to Matthews. Matthews, he looks like he wants to shock it off, but that's blocked and rejected away. That's a hard one to take for Austin Matthews. He's going to make sure he's all set. Now find again to Brody, and he gives a Marner shot on the backhand save. Nees grabs his own rebound, now finding Matthews. Moving the puck back and forth here for the Toronto Maple Leafs as he will give it over to Nees. And he will stop that play inbound as Montour will have it over. Kicked it over, and now here's the take for Verhage. Verhage tried to get in, but it's knocked out. And Marner will have it off on the other side. Finds a run of net. Can't get the play back in handoff. Forcing on his way down. Goes with the nine with the shot as McNabb will, will, McCab will have it over. And firing around the net, McMahon to Nylander. Now here's McCabe. Sorry with American correction. And now McCabe will give again to Bennett. Bennett over now to McCabe. And a shot. This one saved off. Throw me on the backhand. Can't get over with the rebounding. That rebound is a hard one to take. It's not what they always do. You can't let that rebound get right into you if you have that one shot in between. McKay could stop by Bobrovsky with only 11 minutes to go. A lot of takes over, except it's a practice, it's an eye on the switch, gotta get that one roll. A lot of time left in this period with only 11 minutes. It's one nothing Toronto Maple Leafs. And now forcing who has to cover. Cousins gives it an F line, and now here's Kachuk. Kachuk fires that puck around the net. And he now finds the airway, looking for open room. Here's Nylander. Nylander making his way down here, right toward the right side of the wing. And Holmberg will have it over now to Camp. Camp gives again to Riley. Give to Labushkin. He gets up. Cousins will have the fucking rebound, trying to battle along the board. Cousins try to hold on to the puck. Ekblad try to give it again to Kachuk. 9.45 left to go in the first period as we pass the midway mark. Toronto's back in position now. He looks over to Camp. Camp, take a look in order to Reeves' shot. This one stayed off here and it goes back the other way. Austin Reeves can't hold on with the puck. Here's that flat. And Riley has that puck steal. He gets back to Tavares. John Tavares, the captain, now will fire around the net. Give again to Eric Ongo. And McCabe now gives again to Riley. Riley now finds McCabe, gives again to Yonko. Yonko shot, in rebound, scores! Why do you love that? The rebound for John Tavares, extend now 2 0. I love that passing right there. That's Tavares with the rebound, and this one is picked up. Now, the puck went flying. But here's what the take is. John Tavares had that one in the left side of the transition and he was out of the paint. He just made that one and that puck was flying above him. He had that one with a great goal. And made that one clear. 
It's a lot of hard one, but he's been kicking it off well. Now Florida wins the face off, as now Lockwood will have it here in the corner. And he gives it again to Stenlight. McMahon will have that puck. McMahon will fire around the net as Yarnbrook will have it over. Here's a take to Tavares as he has his first goal of a night, gives to Benny. Shot! Glove saved by Mirovsky. 7.50 left to go in the first period. It's a 2-0 game. Off the set to get another face off. And Florida wins the face off. Ekblad trying to look over now. Now he gets to get to Verhege. On the other side, now looking for help. They take the pass, and there's a go-ahead goal for Sam Reinhardt. Close the quarter in the first period. It's a 2-1 game. I like that pass. That close was one a good goal. But the good tension is, you give it off the go again to Sam Reinhardt, and that closing quarter gave us him the first goal of the night. Leading over Samsonov, it's not always easy when you take a lot of chance. All on that point, you make sure you get this one in steady. But he's been doing really well. How impressive he is. Florida wins the face up, and now he finds again to Ekblad. And now Verhege will have his own chance, and now he's lost to Matt Reeves. And now he gives it off to Marner. Marner will have a look again to Matthews. Austin Matthews, now it's back again to Brody. Here's Lundgren, gets again to Matthews. Spins around the corner, trying to look for some help. Brody shoots, left save by Dubrovsky. 6.30 left to go in the first period. A lot of time left in between. Lots of time left in this period. It is still a 2-1 game as we left off here. Florida wins another faceoff as the Panthers will regain the group now find Forsyth. Oh, there's a big hit here. Lilgren, pass broke it out. Here comes Verhege. Verhege on a man rush, went around, but it was too close to the goaltender. Now, man, the bad timing is not really like, but they always expected to say that this one's not really always easy enough. When you give a lot of timing in there, you got to make sure you're on the right track. Because if you don't, then you're going to have a lot of hard, hard work to take. And that pass is going to change it over. And here's again. The shot saved by Samsonov. 521 left to go in the first period. Now with the win, here's Kulikov. He finds it now. And a chuck shot. Good save by Samsonov. That was pretty close now. Samsonov made up in a great save for your attempt. Here's the take for a silver spoon. Matthew Kachuk has its tricky motion ability that takes all of his chance look. The offense doesn't pay him up if he has that tricky shot. Austin Matthews has a shot and all ability. He can take over with this the defender of this in line. And the line is always making changes when he reacts by the goaltender. I have a line to range here and I'll find out if there's another take in between of the meadow, of the land, of, the, of Matthews, over Kachuk, in between. Back to you. Labushka now finds Riley. Riley shot. Another big stop here by the goaltender. And Labushka will now have it over to get to Riley. Riley now sends it over. Loses that puck. Now fires around the net. And here's Nylander. Nylander gives it Labushka to now finding Riley. Riley shot. This one's another bad stop made by, by Bobrovsky. And Bobrovsky made up in the clearly early range. That is like a hard one to take. But not everybody's good at him because he's been really like taking his own time instead of game one and two. And that one goes over the net and it goes over and right toward the wall. What a great save. Matthew Kachuk with only three minutes to go and now he finds again to Cousins. Cousins making his way through. That kind of battle won't stop him. Cousins. He finds it now over. A shot. That's Lybushkin with the puck and there's the delay penalty call on Florida. That's a bad attempting. They do not like this one because they do not pick up that wall at all. That close interference with that play about. Matthew Kachuk in the penalty box. It's gonna be like a hard one, but you're never gonna like. It. 
the Maple Leafs will start their first power play advantage. It's now a 2-1 game. 25 left to go. And now with the win, here's Ekblad. He will now find it over again to Lestrinen. Lestrinen with the puck. Brad will go around. And Forsley will have it over. That fires the puck out. And now it's recovered. Here he comes Stilney on the other side. It's taken along by Tavares. Forsley takes the puck away. Now he finds it over again to Lishkin. Takes it battling for the puck, and their team goes offside. Now still a lot of time left in this period. It's still close where the could make the call in game four. Leafs up by one. Now the win for Forsley. Forsley gives to Lishkin. What a slam down. And now Yonkuk will give it off to Lidgren. And here's McMahon as the team is right now in the Florida Panther zone. Lugren finds it out again to Domi. Domi can't hold on with that puck. Try to hold on for a force lane. Shot and it's been redirected, stopping again by Samsonov. What a good attempt to make the save. But this is not what you're going to do to make an easier look on the setup. In a strange look and a save puts up here by Bobrovsky. He finds again to Yonko. Yonko. Looks it over. McMahon shot. Save it up. The rebound put it in. Going right beside of a net. Warrior minute left to remain in the first period. Looks like his time is almost about to be expired. Yonko loses the puck and the power play is over. They've been doing really well. Every time you play out in a lot of hard in a scrimmage of the game, that's what they always do. They really love that. And that one takes a lot of a hard timing to get that one right in between. They, they, they've really been like, playing hard for it ever since. Well, it's saved by Samsonov, and he will stop the play here as the first period comes down to an end. One more faceoff in the Leafs territory. And Matthews will win the faceoff and will give it off here. Two wins to score. Only one has made that one an incredible save and bound. But it's all for Sam Reinhardt that made that one with the goal. We'll keep you updated here for the next period, but we come back after this. We are all set, ready for the second period. And here we go. We start things off here after cleaning sheet of ice and back on the game. Let's have a take for you guys in between the first periods of the recap. Things have done really well. This offense can't let that one stop in bound. On a deniable range, this one's been really taking a lot of communications in between. But this was not really the day where they really went on to go with. All the time, it just happened to be one of them that has to go with it right between the, between the, in the couple of the range sites. It's not easy when they take a lot. Matthews, what a stop put in for Bobrovsky, and now back the airway. Yeah, I was really seeing that. That was almost going to be a takeover, and Matthews would have that goal. He would have made that with a very good. And a shot stops it again, and now it's Labushkin like over now, finding over again to Marner. Mitchell Marner gets crushed up, as knees will have it out, and offside will be the call. Now they're off to set for a narrow faceoff, and ready to take the goal. Toronto wins the faceoff. And now, Domi will have it over. Try to have it out. Reinhardt, battling along for a loose puck of a chain. Trying to hold on to it. Mikula will have it now over again to Montour. He has it over again to Berhege. Berhege makes his way down, now trying to make his way move. Can't hold on with the puck as the shot went wide. There's double man traffic, and there's a number one that can take over. Now here's again Nylander, he goes right over to get a Brody. Brody takes again to Nylander, and now he finds again to Berterzi. Berterzi shoots, and that one sticked out out, and that broke into stick. Oh, he's going to have to replace a new one already. Can't let that one go right by it. Montour, holding the puck in as McMahon will have it. Takes a big hit. Brody has it now. Oh, big takeover. And now Benham will have it over to Cousins. Cousins right toward inbound, trying to battle along for the loose puck, and Ben 
has his way over. Chuck! And he scores! Stay tied this game up. It's Kachuk with a tricky shot and make it in. Well, this is what happens now. Kachuk doesn't even really score right in between. Not what you want, it's how you do. You know that shot goal doesn't happen to all, most of them. That makes them a lot of quick rebounds. And can't let that one take over you for in between. It's not when you always want to try to like keep on shooting, but you gotta make sure your time is right. There really is gonna be a lot of takeovers in between, and I was having a lot of like a, a better range than that. Hopefully there's another takeover here. Montour will have it now, or he gives it up with the shot. And, and a range! Shames it up, makes a save. Like which can now find Severs. Severs spins it over. On a shot, wrench the, wrist the shot, and makes a save. Donko now finds Labushkin, gives again to Donko. On a shot, this was another big save by, by Bobrovsky. Gives again, now finds McMahon. McMahon can't hold on with the puck, and, and Yonko now finds it again to Riley's shot. Big save by Bobrovsky. Now he's the number one again to Bennett. Bennett trying to work his way across now, and he has to give the pass over, now finding Cousins. Cousins can't hold on with the puck. Cam's got it now, right toward the right wing. And that puck is taken over by Kulikov. Lishkinen will have it over in the, uh, on the right side of it. Now finding gets to Chuck, he scores! Oh man, what a great goal for the Pampers, as they are in front now. Well, they're not happy with that situation because Matthew Kachuk made that one tricky. He, that's why he calls that one a tricky shot. Had that one lifted up the corner. Watch what he does. Flicks it, and then it just missed it. The glove saved by Samsonov. He didn't get this one in time. That should have been happening to anybody who could get there. The Panthers are now on the board, and they're in the lead. Just only coming down to a 13.43 left to go in the second period. Now here's the win as Kolokov will have it. Takes a big hit, and Kemp will try to clear it out. Edmond Larson will have it over on the other side of the range. Gives a fair, fair pass, now finding it over again. Misses the net. Big net, now finding it way over. Reeves, he has it down. Trying to go with the backhander, and a big save puts it in. Stopping by Bobrovsky, who now has another chance. And another take. That one's kicked out, and it's Lustrin in with the puck. Now that's what's happening, because there, there is a bigger offensive changes, and there is a lot of battling, rebounding the puck. It's not what they take, but this is not the other way that they can try to like, lead that out of the zone. Means will have it over, now finally again McKay. McKay, pass to Matthews, broke it up. Marner, kicks the puck, now finding knees. Here's a take from Matthews, he scores! On his one-time shock and all ability on the goaltender. That's what happens, Austin Matthews make that good goal. That's a great up here. Now he tied us up. Now watch what happens. Austin Matthews gives a good look, takes a back end, and has that one rip rocket through. When you give a pass to, to the open knees, give to Matthews, you gotta give a go-ahead goal. That was a great chance he made. That's right, guys. I was really seeing it, but, but they all say for Austin Matthews, he's been really like keeping an eye on the strength. Hoping he might keep on coming down if he get there. Lowbread, he went down as he will face another hit. Marner, can't hold on with the puck. Ekblad, Barkov, gives it for Hagee. Now with another take. In the corner, trying to find again with a shot. Another big save by Samsonov. Oh, he's been really well at it. Got to keep on shutting it down if you can. Now he has to take in between. The goaltenders are going to be like a hard one to take. Well, it's a lot of more possible takes. I mean, I must say, they're going to let that, that one happen right away. Right in between of those two. May not be what they were looking for because they really are trying to like get that one shut down. But this offense may not be what they were looking for. Hopefully there's a change off if they can. Ford saying with the buck now has it the airway as the Florida Panthers regain the group. 
Fouling along from the puck with the ranges, Brody will have that out. And Logren has that one across. The saucer! And that one's broken up the pass as Nylander has it out. Now it gives off to Lindgren. The pass to Domi. Domi shoots! Bobrovsky makes another save. 9.32 left to go in the second period. And they still need to get this goal straight away. Leafs still trying to get that goal back. It's still a tie game. The Maple Leafs are back in the offensive zone, and now Lagushkin gives it again to Riley. Riley shoot up, and glove saved by Bobrovsky. A great screen for Paterzi, but it still have not gone in there. As right now, if you're looking for the next part of the game, we've got the Nashville Predators facing against the Dallas Stars here at Bridgestone Arena. That will be happening here at 8 o'clock p.m. Following along with the part of the next game as the 10.30 p.m. will be the Kings versus against the Vancouver Canucks back at Crypto.com Arena. That will be all the part of the next games coming up on its way soon. And Game 5 will be the next one to take over on the other side of the ring. You'll see them very soon on our way. Don Cook got firing again to Riley. Here's another take here. Will he take another look? And this one is back, back to a broken pass. And DeVeers has it again to Riley. Here's Lagushkin. Lagushkin will try to hold on. And McMahon has it. He looks it over in the pass. Can't hold on. Lagushkin finding DeVeers. Great look, but it didn't help. Taking the puck back to where it belonged. It's not what he's doing. He's not giving it up an offense. It's not what he's going to go for. Every play in his motion is a step by step. You have to make sure you have to keep an eye on it and a looking target angle. That's what you need to know. Keep that ice stipe at a right angle. Now here's the call for Mitchell Marner. Mitchell Marner on his third eye take, he has lots of good pressure to take all of his passing lane. His million is a percentage to take all of his time worth of credit. Let's see what Mitchell Marner has if he takes his third eye. Back to you. The blockers stop made here as it now at Bobrovsky gives the Matthews shot. A big save by Bobrovsky. 6.45 left to go in the second period. Still a tie game. Now here's a big win. It's Brody. Oh, that's a big hit down there in the corner of the wall. And that process is broken up. Matthew Kachuk now finds Mikola. He finds Montour. Montour working his way across. His knees takes a puck seal. Lundgren trying to make his way across. Over now to Marner shot. Went wide. Hit the board and it goes back again to Cousins. Well, that is a tricky backhander. He's way off the mark. Can't let that one fool over if he can get that one through. Samsonov's going to hold it. And now Lundgren will have it out with 5.30 to go. There's a lot of big range out there. There's a lot of big attackers. Florida Panthers are trying to get that one out of the way. They can't let that one get spooled over because of what they did is they really are just making that one clear. It's not what they are going for, but don't take the risk of it if they have it. Now finds a pass to Bertuzzi. And now he's off again to the races. Cuts in sliding down. Now trying to find him some more room as McKay. Has that puck. Now finds again the new leader. Nylander takes his own time. Shot! Scores! What a shot here. Nylander with his first goal ahead goal in game four. Now that's easy to take because Nylander was picking it up right at that moment. Move out of my way. Now that's a pretty good uh, tightness to take. Great screen and that's what the big defense hook covered over because that's what he's been picking up as puck on strength. Been working so hard every one of the season along the way. And I see that. Jake McCain just saw that deliberation right between William Nylander. He made out with his puck on strength to go right from his between tricks. This offense can't let that one slow down a bit, but it's not for long of what they've done better to get right from here. I'll find out if William Nylander gets another go. Oh, uh, here's Cam. Oh, what a big stop by Dabrowski. Oh, that was a good take for Bobrovsky to have that one saved. Not for anybody who's good at it. 
He's been looking like he wants to get right into it. Not a win here for Barkov. And I'm glad we'll have it over now again to Barkov. Slips the corner now, find Riley. And Legushkin. Fires around the net. Holmbrook's got it now. Right between the net of the surface. Now he finds it over to again to Reeves. Reeves now finds Riley. Reeves passes now back to Legushkin. 2.45 left to go. Big pat stop by Bobrovsky. Only 2.38 to go in a second period. Now they're off to do this one again. Four threes to score for Toronto Maple Leafs. And it's Matthews with the winning faceoff. Meeks tries to backhand. Takes a diving release bit after, after a close call in between of the Florida Panthers for tripping over. Reinhardt. Now finds Rodeghi. Touch shot by Watt. He's missing it. Can't shoot it until you get it done right. Maybe it might be a stick handling problem, or it could be a puck fall. Nothing's going to happen to slow it down, but don't take too much credit if you're going with the goal. Matthew's shot. This one stopped again, as forcing will now have it over. The other side goes to Ekblad, and now he finds a Rodeghi. Bray makes his way down and now tries to make a shot. A big save by Samsonov. Final minute remaining in the first in the second period as now it's forcing. Lundell shot. Big save here. Off to Bertuzzi. Bertuzzi will dump that puck out. Gives it over. And now Matthews will have it out. 30 seconds left in the second period as Benning will now have it over. Makes his way across. Matthews. In behind the net. Looks again. Nylander. Tipped up. Right toward the glass. And try to pick it up. Roderick Goose. Will he take his time to shoot? And that one stayed up. But as here for the second period is a go-ahead goal for Nylander. 4-3. Be right back with the third. But we're having fun for the game as we have come down to the third period after the second. And this is where it comes down to this. Four threes to score. Let's see who wins it. And this one is a big battling crucial in between. Let's have your takes here for a recap of the second period. Well, their score is going to be like a takeover. This amount is not going to let that happen. This one has really been like a big escape of the night. And the Florida Panthers has been really been knocking over it to stop by the Toronto Maple Leafs. They can't let that one shoot down alone. They have to find another way to get from here. We'll find out if the Leafs can try to like step it back in there. They need to make sure they have that one at their target. Yeah, I've got a pretty good range in between it, so hopefully it can be a little bit tricky to get there. Here's a pass like which can shot. Bobrovsky makes another save. 18 29 starts in the third. It's still a 4 3 game. The Maple Leafs. Now the whip puts it up, and now back again to Cousins. Ligwishkin watching him. Here's a take. Shot! Big save here by Samsonov. Now we'll try to figure out to Riley. Riley has to make his way over towards it again to Bertuzzi as he went down. Bumbling it again is Cousins. Cousins makes his way in. That big smackdown puts the Leafs in the territory zone. Now finds it again to, to Labushkin and, and Nylander fired a puck around the net. And Bertuzzi will have it. Here's a take here for Labushkin. Avoid a spill as Stormy will have it over. And now find again a birdie looking again to Bertuzzi. Bertuzzi got a spill here. That's going to be like a hard hit. It's not what you all have to do. Don't measure it until you take some time. That shot goes wide. Aaron Eckblad loses the puck. And that one can't find an open look to clear the buck zone. And a shot. Oh! That takes it out. Samsonov makes another big save. And it goes right behind the net. Oh, give me that slam back of the puck. That's Brody's idea to mess up that. Oh, he's been really like he's going to take over his time. 
I never see when it goes on this. A house will be one of the idea. Samsonov, what a great save. 1542 left to go in a third third period. 4-3 set. Now for the way, here's Brody. Brody will have his own time. Now he has already hit a little break. And Robert Hughes will have that puck in between. Shutting it down as Lester may have to begin to Montour. Makes a big stop by Samsonov on a pad. He fires that one around the net. John Brook over again, now finding Lugren. And Sick left it, still hold on. Now he finds John Brook. Looks now again to Lugren and try to find in the middle to Brody. This one can't get over. Montour's got the puck and now he finds it again on Lester. Makes a new line changing here as now the Panthers will bring a new group. Here's Austin Matthews on his way down. The pass. Broken up by the play of Reinhardt. Brady has that one in right towards the left wing. And here's Barkov shot. He scores. They tie this game up. Oh boy. Barkov had that one coming. That captain's going to free it off. Now you see what happens now because Alexander Barkov has made that one with a great slip. That move is nowhere between a look of in between a one on one offense and defense here by the goaltender against the player. He was really wondering if he wants to do it for it. I'm ready to take the face off. And this one, he does it all. It's a tie game now. Florida Panthers are trying to make a comeback here in the in the fourth game to tie the series up. And now he lost that buck as Montour will have it. Montour gets back again to Mikola. Mikola finds Verdigi. Can't hold on to the puck as Barkov will now have it over again to Sam Reinhardt. Has that back again to Barkov. If it's the lead, this one's back again by the net. By the glass, and now back again to McKay with 13 minutes. Now he finds it again to Austin Matthews. Matthews avoids a spill, and now finds Benet. Here goes Matthews. Matthews spins around, hit the goal post. Borghegi now tries to give off to Montour, and he gets it over now to get to Reinhardt. And here's a chance for Barkov to take the lead. This one stopped again, as another one puts up for Sezanov. Now the puck went around the net. Reeves got it now. Towards the corner, now finds Bennett. McCabe's shot. Didn't handle the leg, stick lift here, and this goes right back to Reeves. And McKay backhand scores! Wow! I got a good feeling for McKay. He got that goal. Well, you know, that's what McKay has really been getting it out. The tie chain is broken. Now, that's what you were saying things before. When you blind that goaltender, you felt like you have no idea what's going on around you. But McKay does this. He makes that one of timing motion. So where am I? Oh, right. And he had that goal. That's the take over here. As Cam had that one assist, they're coming down here fast. The Florida Panthers wins another faceoff. It's Montour will now have it again to Lindo. And Reeves will have it over. The offense now finds Camp and will fire that puck out. Here's Montour, now finds Lindell. Lundell, excuse me. Lundell now finds again to Listerman and now finding Montour. Montour gets slammed right toward the board, near the board. Now he finds Listerman and shot. This one way high off the mark. And he goes back over again to the Leafs territory, to the Pampers territory. Domi. Now has to begin to light Bushke. Riley. Ooh, almost made that one spilled out. Knocking it over, now finding again to Libushkin. Gives a pass to Riley. Buck leaves his own. We'll try to dump it out, and now the Panthers will go get it. Lundell will have his own time, and now finding again to Montour. He finds again to Rodriguez. He goes over now to Lesterman. Lesterman will have that puck leave it out. Riley. Off to Libushkin. The Leafs are making its way down. He landed a shoot for returns and scores! Wow, what a takeout! 
New Jersey had his first goal in the playoffs. Uh, he's really been keeping out there for so long. New Jersey with a great go-ahead goal. Went after the pass puts in for Nylander. He got that great good good look for, for New Jersey. He made this run go in. That's a great stoppage to put right beating the goaltender, and that one takes all the time. Great work. Well, it's a good look. William Nylander had that one with his high percentage out there. Made it clearly the easier look he has been taking all of his pressure in there, and he's been looking like he wants to get a take it all. But it's not for long. He has it all covered in there to do for one of his tricks all his time angle. We'll find out if Tyler Bedusi has another goal to take from Nylander. Back to you. Lost that puck, his cousins will have it now. Now has to finally get to Ekblad. Eggblad makes his way down over into the other side. Trying to lift it out. Santanov takes a stop here and it will cover her up here in the corner. Here's Eggblad. Gives to Cousins. That's blocked. That one's two in a row. Santanov makes it over to make save. Pampers are in the full pressure. And Barkov denies that shot as Santanov takes a stop. What a big save. Let's look at it one more time here for Santana. That one takes a lot of big saves here. Two times in a row. You're not going to get rid of that one here, and you're not going to be over the goaltender. Now he has to make sure he's all covered and protected. It's not what he does. He makes it clearly a hard one to take over his life. That is a hard one to maintain its pressure. No way you can't do. You can't let that one roll out. Here's Reinhardt on the backhander. This one's been stopped, and now again the Marner. Marner will clear the puck out into the Panthers' territory. And they got some tired defensemen now as it falls icy. The Florida wing of Slippe face off. Big save by the goaltender. And Bennett will have it over to get a knees. Knees now finds Marner. Marner will have to give it over to Bobrovsky. And that puck's still by Marner. Here's Knees shot. Blocked it away here and it goes back now. Finding over with a look at by Mark Matthews and now McKay will have it. And Matthews got that puck. On his shot. Can't hold on to it now. As Bobrovsky's gonna hold it with only 6 of 6 to go. A lot of time left in this period. It is now a 6-4 game to run on Maple Leafs. Florida wins the faceoff and now Reinhardt give again to Ekra Larson. Kolokov now finds Barkov and now we're here's Verhege. Verhege shot, big save by Samsonov. That's how you can handle it. A lot of pressure is making it sense, but it's for the Leafs' job to try to hold on to it. Sam Reinhardt has his closing corners in his game. The better percentage doesn't happen to be one of his only technique after you've already saw that one for the first period. It turned to be a little bit hard on the range out there, but I'll find out if the close corner comes in for the third. Icing's way still out, waved off in between, and now he finds it again, and Barkov will take the puck. We're just down to five minutes remaining in the third period. He will now have his own time looking for an open look to Reinhardt. Off to Barkov. Barkov scores! Back to back scores in between Toronto and Florida. Oh well, I am not saying that Alexander Barkov had that one with a great look at it. Take that screen and says, Look who's this? He just made that one, he just broke somebody up. That almost could have been an ankle breaking on the goaltender for sure. What a player! I have not seen that one coming in now, but it looks like he's trying to keep that out for sure. Here's a take for here for Nylander. He will now have his own look. Firing around the net, and now it's Domi. Domi now finds it again to Lebrushkin and again to Riley. Riley got a shot. Big save here by the goaltender. And now finding it again to Kachuk. Flores back in the offensive zone as Ekman Larson will try to give off to Bennett. Bennett to give a tie run, and will hold here for Samsonov with just uh, only 3.43 left to go. Here's the call. 
Let's take you over to Silver to Silver Spill. Matthew Kachuk has really been really well playing his perfect performing offense, and his ultimate timing of this one is not going to take a lot to make the inspection go by. It's really like a hard one, but he's been like doing really well for himself. We'll see what Game Five does if he makes a tricky zone with that shot. Work ahead. More to come. More to be going in between. Final three minutes in the third period, as this one will stop and by as Lindgren will have it. And that one skipped out as Tony will have it over. He goes down and here's Reinhardt. Here's Barkov. Shot! Big save here by the goaltender. Lindgren now finds again a Nylander and now it's open pass to Matthews. Matthews for two! Saved again by Bobrovsky. Brigitte now finds Ekman Larson. Two minutes remaining in the third period. Still looking to get a goal to tie it up. Barkov can't hold on with the puck and take three goals for a hat trick as it's stopped by the goaltender. Here down the mark, here's a shot, and this one is tipped up and out of the play. Now you're ready to do another face-off. Six fives to score. Florida wins again, and a big save by the goaltender. A lot of chance here for the Florida Panthers, and Barkov is trying to get back into work. Now this offense can't really like make them pressure. This losing strength is going to take a lot of time, and it may not be what you want to go with, but you can't let that one fool down. And Samson on a big save, and this one will stop down with 1-11 to go in the third period. Now his timing is going to take over and you're bringing an extra skater on near the final minute in the third. And Toronto will win it again. Last minute remaining in the third period. And they're about to take things on as the Maple Leafs will carry an icing. After they clear the puck out, now the fans are ready to take things on as the extra skater will appear. And the win. Here's a now chance. And a shot blocked up by Yonka. Extra skater's on and McMahon will send it out. Blocked a shot by Eklad. And Yonka. Looks like his team has been really repping it up that point. Yeah, definitely so. They can't let that one get right away because they've been really big crushing it off. McMahon lost that one. Kitchuk makes another big save by Samsonov. And there is a good ahead chance. Goal score. John Tavares wins this game in game four. It's now a 3-1 series in the first round. Playoff and mount. John Tavares can win that game and open up. John Tavares and her team are lighting it up here in Toronto, and that will be the end of it. And now for the final few seconds, as Brody will bring her team to a legendary win, as the buck will clear out, and that is gonna do it. The Maple Leafs win this game against the Panthers. Well, it's a so long and good night, and for a great win, all for Sentinel, and for the rest of the team, They've been doing great. Well, it's Big Star. Big ways to help them and support. We all great salute to the fans. It's great having it, and we all appreciate them. What a great night. As of right now, Light Bulb along with Ballpoint Pen and Tyler Beast with Silver Spoon. This has been a presentation of the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. Thank you all for tuning us in, and we'll see you again next time. Have a great night, everybody. All right, thank you so much. Final score, 7-5, Toronto Maple Leafs. Time for three star players of the game. We have the Florida Panther, and it's Alexander Barkov that had two goals in this game. Then, the second star goes to John Tavares with his two goals and one hit. Only took his time right now, and he has it all in through. Then, your first star player of the game, all goes with one, and that turns off Jake McKay. A goal and two assists. He's done a great job 
all deflect it and put it in right behind the net to make that tricky move on the backhand shot near the goaltender. That is a crazy one to take. Now let's have a look at your total statistics. 42 over 39 for Florida. Then it was 39 over 30 for Toronto. 14, 4, 4 over 507 for the time on attack for Toronto. 94 over 979 for Florida's passing zone. 28 faceoff wins over 16 for Florida. Two minute penalty kill was Florida and only no power play goal has made. So it's only nothing and only two minute power play goal minute was Toronto. Well, I guess that's pretty much it right now and I hope you enjoyed this game there too. Stick around as we've got the Predators versus Stars at Nashville to get this thing started and we've got your things uncovered. It's coming up here next later and of course the Kings versus against the Canucks at, at Los Angeles here at Crypto.com Arena. Thanks for watching and peace out folks for a while as the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports. This is Boomer signing you out. Until then. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.